Well, I think these deals are, are really interesting, and I think the leagues have decided to really put their, the smartest people you know, in charge of sports betting. Um, and, and I think it's, been, it's a great thing. You know, one of our portfolio companies, Swish Analytics, which is actually here in, in London with us, Swish is now one of the authorized data providers for Major League Baseball. And we think that's a great move. It's a great move to have the innovative companies along with the leagues working hand in hand to figure out what's next, to figure out what will the fan experience be like in the future? How will you actually engage more with the sport? And so I think these relationships, what, it, what they are today is not what they're gonna be in the future, but at least we're getting started. And we're getting, we're getting that back and forth between the leagues, the entrepreneurs, the companies that are really thinking about building this industry. And we're just super excited about the fact that they're now open to it. The fact that the leagues are open to this, the fact that they're really thinking about how to really innovate and move forward and really move their business forward, is, is really exciting, especially for us because of the entrepreneurial young businesses that we invest in that are really trying to think about the next, next thing within sports and sports betting. Today's sports betting industry has to really wake up and, and take a look at the consumer and really start to think about who will, be the, who will that consumer be in the future? Because it's not just gonna be all male. It's not just gonna be older guys who just love betting, who understand what minus 180 is, who really understand the over-unders, who understand what money lines are. It's going to be the casual player. It's going to, they're going to, the demo's gonna look different. How we as an industry decide to really start to change the way we do things and present these opportunities to everybody is gonna be the opportunity. So there will be a complete democratization of this industry. It will not just be the old time you know, um, sports better. It's gonna look different and I think that what's exciting is as at 76 Capital, what we're all about is looking for those opportunities, looking for those entrepreneurs who are looking at the business differently, who are starting to think about targeting other individuals who actually are not engaged today. Maybe because they just don't know, or maybe because they're just, they've been told for many, many years that you don't bet, betting's a bad thing. That's something that now in the US, that whole world has just been blown up where you now have 13 states, right, that actually have legalized sports betting. I think it's really an exciting time, and I really truly believe that the, the, the demographics of this industry will totally shift, and the sports betting apps and technology will totally change. I think that when you start to look at the way the apps look today, they're gonna look different in the future. When, you know, in, in, you know, I think you think when you kind of see what's happening today where you, you have you know kind of the traditional look of a lot of the, the sports betting apps, they're gonna to start to look more like Facebook. They're gonna look more like Instagram. They're gonna be a way more visual than they've ever been. And that's something that we a lot of the industry has not thought about yet. But there are entrepreneurs that are working on some really fascinating new new developments.